So did y'all see Sneeko's weekend? I saw, your I saw Twitter. Had a, he weekend. had a horrible weekend, boy. Man. Oh, yeah, it went crazy too, gang. Yeah, Sneeko had a terrible. <laughs> terrible. A terrible, terrible. I thought it couldn't get worse from just that one day. I remember just one day was like like three bad things happened to him. So first he got pieced up by Sean Strickland. And I don't think I can play that video, but he, he severely got po- pieced up by he Sean got- up. He didn't fall though. Shout out to him. Yeah, he got pieced up by Sean Strickland. But again, I don't think that that's some of the worst stuff that happened in the video. I think what what not. I mean, the weekend. I should say. I think some of the worst stuff is him getting ignored by Kai and Speed. I have it. I have it right here. Him getting flat out ignored by Asho Speed and Kai. Yeah. Can you please wait with Sneeko? Man, that nigga doing everything to look around you. Oh, that's a lot. Thank you. Yeah. Yo, it's crazy, Omar. After I I seen this, I just remembered like, yo, it wasn't too long ago when like Sneeko used to hang out like around the AMP crew and them. When he was at so, the house, when he was actively at the house. Yeah. So for them to just, I'm pretty sure they did it on purpose to act like he didn't exist is kind of crazy. Oh, oh, a, a thousand percent. Um, and I I don't even think. That that was damn, and some more stuff happened to him. God, sometimes why you wait for the video? I don't even think that that was the worst one. The worst one was the Steve will do it one. The Steve, I'm say, yeah. Oh, with yeah. Charles Barkley. That- no, hold on. There's hold on. another one. The Steve- there was one where like he was sitting down at a table, and I guess he either ignored him. Yeah, not fully ignoring him. I hear. Can I just sit? This cigarette. Oh. Are you chain smoking? Or- yeah. Can I get one too? Oh, all right, damn man! Got around, so. Come, cause I'm a mumble or something. Uh-huh. Oh, he won't even look as well. Embarrassing. Oh no, this is actually awkward. Oh my god. Yo, just walk out the room, bro. Just, just leave. Just leave. Just leave. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what game this is either. Yeah, I don't know. Back right. Where'd you guys have that other table here? Okay. Oh my god, oh my god, just leave, bro. Just leave, just leave, please. Filipinos are gone. Oh my god, this is. Yeah, I'm bored. No, I'm good. That's a lot telling me not to smoke. You just ask for. I know, I know, but he oh, that said so that was a sign from, from my law. I hear. Oh my god. Oh man. <laughs> it just kept getting worse. Oh my god. I'm just give me a cigarette. No, I'm okay. I don't, I don't, I don't want to smoke. Just act for one. No, no, no. It's a sign. Yeah, Sneeko, that's that's bad, gang. I thought Steve will do it was like an edge lord too, though. That's my only confusion with that whole thing. Um, I mean, just because you're an edge lord, don't mean you gotta fuck with every edge lord or a nigga deemed edge lord. He might just not fuck with Sneeko. He's in the group up lately. I don't know. I mean, I I I had the 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 talking point about it. I, I mean, I, I made a whole video about it, so I don't necessarily want to repeat it, mm-hmm. but. This is this is what happens when you just go too far. Like this is what happens when you just push all the way too far. And people always say, "Oh, well, you got your fan base and all this stuff." But being an outcast at the streamer event, seeing the trajectory that Sneeko was on, and I'm not even—I'm talking about before AMP. Sneeko was with Mr. Beast. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like before Mr. Beast became this thing, won a won a whole contest about creativity with Mr. Beast, and to see that he's this now, it's crazy. Yeah. They they can about his potential, and honestly, because he's good at making content, like he could be up there with the likes of uh, Kai Aiden if if he just took the right path, but just didn't do it. Damn. To be honest, I know that sounds crazy. Yeah, he could. <clears throat> yeah, like you know, he, he really could. He, he has the charisma. He has the the creativity, the back end skills. Knows how to work social media. It's just he went down that red pill path because it was hot at that time. And now that it's not hot, trying to pivot out of it. He even said, like, yo, I'm done with red pill shit. Like, uh, IRL streaming's the new shit. And then he did a bunch of those streams with Neon. So, yeah, that was the pivot he went in. He just chose wrong, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Go deep, boy, I'm telling you. Yeah, when the... um. 
I'll, I'll even break the fourth wall just a wee bit because, oh, my God, we swore not to do this again. But when we had our um, what I refer to the negative arc where a lot of our shit was just dunking on people, it I was never I, I, I promised to the highest high, lowest lows. It was never getting canceled by like Twitter and shit that I was afraid of. What I am genuinely actually like, yo, I don't want to do this. Get blackballed by all my other peers. That's crazy. The, the the sponsors, the the other creators that could give you opportunities, and honestly, even the even the creators that you're above now. Uh, that is a crazy thing. Even in um even on the solo shit, when I was like a heavy basketball ranter, and people were just like, bro, rant about this, rant about that. Oh, and I'll go, I'm not even angry. <laughs> and one person will go, hey, bro, but that's your thing, bro. No, because at some point, when you burned every bridge check. Now, now you're now you're looking at it as a profession. When you burned every bridge, and first of all, you burned every bridge. So what the fuck you lighting on fire this time? And then two, it's like damn, like this is all on me. And I, that's a tough spot to be in as an entrepreneur, where you have to essentially create a new mold. So unless this nigga invented the purple pill or some shit, it it had been it was kind of this was kind of like Destin. Um, it's always awkward to see those situations, but I hate to be that guy. He had it coming. He kind of he had it coming the way he was going about it because he was willing to just essentially come on anybody's platform and just be that guy. He was essentially the, nah, women are stupid. Uh, nah, you're being stupid. You're an intel shit like that. So, like, he kind of asked for it, but it is awkward to see. Hopefully, there's some way he can bounce back because this is, I don't give a fuck. This is cringe. I ain't gonna lie. I can't, couldn't watch that shit. Uh, Glorilla said it best. You made your bed, so stay there. I ain't gonna lie. Um, he chose his path. We can sit here and talk about the oh man, he was on this trajectory. He had the potential to be this, that, and the third. You made your decision. You decided to hang with Fresh and Fit. You decided to fly out to Romania and chill with Andrew Tate. You decided to go on the Rumble Wave. You decided to do things the way you decided to do them. And now you reap the repercussions of that. Niggas aren't gonna like you. Niggas gonna hear the stuff that you're saying. People aren't gonna want to fuck with it. People aren't gonna aren't gonna like you. I personally think it's whacker to sit there and see niggas not fucking with you and just um just like 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 I don't know. Be weird about it. Like all right, niggas ignore me. Fuck it. Get out of there. Like I'm with Sage. Nigga leave. All right. If it's like this, fuck it. I'm out. Y'all got yeah. it. If, if, if you're not fucking with me, I'm not about to sit here and sit over your shoulder and. Be all weird about like nah, it's not worth it. That's just wow. I, I will say I thought the red pill show was gonna last longer than this though. Hell, I didn't no. think it was gonna. Maybe I, I, was I, I didn't think it was gonna last forever. forever. I didn't think it was gonna last forever, but to die off this quick, this fast was kind of crazy to me. They were burnt because I just, I just felt like the topics they were gonna the, that they do talk about it's like evergreen content, you know. No, I was too hyper. It was just too hyperbolic. That's it was the, shock yeah. value. It was a it was a shock value thing. So like, if I sit there, it's kind of like how um you like eventually people are like numb to skip saying shit about LeBron. It's kind of like yeah. that. But how many people do you even want to hear this from to begin with? So eventually, you either you either because it was just Skip hating on LeBron, he lasted for so long. But if Skip had like literally fifty versions of him on every fucking show, at some point, nah, that it, that shit would have died earlier. And then he double. I mean, he keeps doubling down. Oh, man. It was awesome. Lord, not Chuck. It wasn't really comfortable with the women doing this shit. I'm not gonna lie. Uh -oh. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They should be in the kitchen. <laughs> oh my god. First of all, you better be careful. <laughs> they say that shit. But I don't want to get fired. Okay. <laughs> hey, I don't want to say that shit. I don't want to. I see how hard the aqua season. That's not yeah. my point. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are nasty. Big wow. ass. Is this not like some some lame ass shit to do? Just sitting there with your phone out, just. <laughs> oh, I thought that was just... Jesus Christ! It's nah. not even him. Look at the who's this nigga behind him? Who's the peanut head next to him doing it? That's so but weird. Put your phone up. Control of chicks, okay? Don't disrespect. I don't know. Fuck him. Put your phone up, nigga. Be in the moment. Live life. Like, what are we doing? Oh, God, God though. This is your man. I, I mean, yes, I, I, I do indulge in a little bit of acting. Big act. Relax, relax. Big act. Oh my! God. You look like Flapjack laughing. 
Ay, ay, ay. Ay, now he's bored. 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 That was crazy. But but like that's what I mean, souls. <laughs> that motherfucker's bored, Chad. <laughs> but that's what I mean though. Like you'd walk up to Charles Barkley frame one, not it belong in the kitchen. Like, what the fuck? Like, yeah. and then the fact that some niggas are gonna be like, come on, Chuck, say what you no, nah, just say like, what you really feel. <laughs> you know you agree, Chuck. Say what you really feel, Chuck. Like that's just, Mind you, Charles Barkley is like, me, like that's how I'm like, what? Charles Barkley is like, is this guy in that? No. <laughs> <laughs> I know somebody in the comments. I knew how Omar was gonna be 32 minutes in. Okay. <laughs>